and welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And on the menu, live action from Serie A coming right up. It's Atletico Mineiro, and they take on Fortaleza. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, 3-5-2 is a great system if you can get control of the midfield because your wing-backs can then play higher up the pitch and the front two can combine as a pair, but they need to dominate that central area. On a pass that lacks quality. Promising attack this. And teammates to play it to. And not the best clearance. Lost to attack from the wide areas. A terrific pass. And a goal! They start as they mean to continue. They make the opening statement. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. But when he shoots, I expect him to go across the goalkeeper. He should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post. That's not good keeping. Well, they're eyeing that final pass, you just feel. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Well, a good tackle. Opportunity! Can they stop it going in? Just cleared away in the nick of time. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Hulk. Saraccio in with a chance well the keeper was called upon and delivered well he's so good in those 1v1 moments and he's proved it yet again Well, the hosts have had so much of the ball in the last 15 minutes and with it have created some great openings. They certainly look as though they get another before Oh, wait a minute, long. Stuart. Look what's happening. Can they put it away? And a goal! Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that. Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper because he makes a very good save to start with. Where are his defenders following in? It's the attackers that get there first, and it's a very good finish. Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game, they've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. No real conviction in the challenge. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Can they take advantage of the situation? 
Well, it was so easy on the eye, that counter-attack, but no reward for them. Yeah, it was all good until the final effort. It just shows how devastating they can be on the break, though. Well, fine use of the ball. Enriquez. On the ball, Felipe. Oh, he's really opened them up here. And what a magical save it was. Counter-attacking, very much an option. And if you're wondering about... He's in here. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening, and they played really well. What a performance that was today.